Hey, I'm Christy Simpson. Today's question is, how do you make it about Jesus? How do you make kids choir, the rehearsals, the musicals, fun get-togethers, etc., about Jesus? Well, I don't know. How do we make it all about Jesus, right? Um, obviously, prayerfully before him praying about your program. That's the first step. And then I don't know if I always do make it all about Jesus, and I want to. Um, the first thing that I think can make a really big difference, especially for those of us that are um, have kids in our programs that may not know the Lord or may be new in their walk with the Lord, is to pray uh, before you do things, right? And in your prayer, you can say, we love you, Jesus. We know this is about you. Everything we do, when we sing, when we blah, 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 it's about you, Jesus. If you do that every time, that's going to start to seep into them, right? Even more than if you gave a big sermon about it, um, the, the, the habits that we build with our kids, I think, will sink in. So if we pray, if we um, are intentional about what we're praying for, rather than just like, bless our rehearsal, thank you, bye, amen, <laughs> you know, if we um, teach a little bit in our prayer and then repeat that over and over again, kids are going to start um, knowing that more. And I know for me, um, I've gotten on Christians in my group. Sometimes I, I feel like, oh, should I even pray? This is kind of a community thing. No, of course we're going to pray, right? Uh, let's pray about things. Let's remind them, even in just little um, sentences in between. Uh, not every song talks about Jesus. Uh, most of my songs that I write, I try to be, make based off of scripture. But even those scripture songs aren't necessarily talking about Jesus, right? So the more we can just say, uh, just tie things together. Remember, do you know that right now, even when we're working hard, this brings praise to God. Jesus is glorified when we work with all our hearts and it's like worship. It's worship to him, even when we're working hard, things like that. Now we've got to be intentional because honestly, I don't think to say that all the time, right? When I'm in the crunch and we're just trying to get things done and you're annoyed at the kids that are talking. Um, so this is actually probably, how do you make it about Jesus? Make it about Jesus for yourself first, and then hopefully be intentional, and that will pour out of us. Uh, make it about Jesus when we talk to our volunteers so that it pours out of them. I think we're going to need to intentionally talk about it. My husband leads our adult choir, and um, we go over these um, guidelines every week, usually mission statement. And the first one is, it's all about Jesus. But he, And he says it all the time, and it's Kind of annoying sometimes where you're like, yes, it's all about Jesus. But you know what? Repetition, that reminds us what we're there for. And it's good. And I'm sorry, dear, that I said it was annoying because it's not that annoying. But sometimes repetition is what gets it into our hearts um, and our minds. So let's remember that it's all about Jesus.